All right, so here we have a true or false question. And the question says, the left ventricle makes up the majority of the anterior view of the heart. Now, in order to answer this question, you have to have an idea of what the anatomy of the heart is. Often when we look at the ECG, you know, we have a number of leads, we mentioned these inferior leads, but knowing the anatomy is really helpful in uh, ascertaining what's going on on that ECG, okay? So we actually get that 3D picture. So let's kind of review the anatomy of the heart, okay? So right here in the image, you can see this is the right atrium. Okay, over here we have our left atrium. This would be the right ventricle and left ventricle. All right, you have the pulmonary artery that goes out to the lungs here. All right, and then you also have the aorta coming from the left ventricle that's going out to the rest of the body. Remember, blood flows from the right atrium to the right ventricle to the lungs, gets oxygenated, comes to the left side of the heart from the left atrium through the mitral valve, out the left ventricle, the aortic valve into the rest of the body. And then you have this closed loop system. Okay, now when we talk about the anterior portion of the heart and the posterior portion of the heart, okay, anterior meaning the front and posterior the back, okay, what we have to do here is know where things are. And one thing you have to remember, and I think what you'll find helpful, is remember that the most anterior portion of the heart, so most anterior, represents the right ventricle. Okay, so you can certainly already see that this question is false, all right? So this is asking about the left ventricle being the most anterior portion, okay? But in fact, it's the right ventricle. So this is false, but let's look at why that's the case. So the right ventricle sits here, okay? And this is the most anterior portion of it. In fact, the left ventricle is mostly posterior, all right? And that's when we use those precordial leads, V1 and V2, sitting over the anterior chest. They tend to be those right-sided leads because they're giving us a better picture of the right side of the heart. Now, if you wanted an actual better view of the right side, if there was a right ventricular infarct, you may in involve those right-sided leads, all right? So again, knowing the anatomy of the heart is very important, and that's why we constantly want to enforce uh, these certain things because it'll help you with what you see on the ECG. So again, this question is asking, does the left ventricle make up the majority of the anterior portion of the heart? And that is certainly false, okay? It is not the left ventricle, it's the right ventricle that makes up the anterior portion of the heart. All right, I hope you learned something. Please don't forget to like this video and leave a comment below if you like what we're doing. In fact, many of you have asked how you could help us out. Really, the best way you could do is simply subscribe and share this resource with your friends. And you get free access to more than 300 videos. There is also a community of over 270,000 of us like-minded individuals on Facebook. So stop over and join the EKG Guys uh, Facebook community. Many of you have also asked some questions. Leave them below or share them on Facebook and we can try to answer them with a short video so everyone else can learn. We also have a number of new courses with corresponding videos coming out soon, so stay tuned for those. Last but certainly not least, your feedback is incredibly helpful and your kind words are always an encouragement on those long days. So let us know how we're doing. Thank you again for your support. It is truly appreciated. We're the largest, fastest growing EKG resource in the world.